New at 6, the Kentucky Department of Education published their report card results and some troubling trends are showing. 44 News is digging deeper into why certain groups of students are falling behind in literacy and what schools are doing to help improve their scores. 44 News reporter Josh Myers has that story from Owensboro New at 6. With the release of this year's Kentucky Department of Education school report card, many school districts are finding that their grades aren't where they'd like them to be, especially when it comes to reading. With the learning loss through COVID and those types of things that we kind of knew that uh, some of our numbers were going to be lower. Obviously, the numbers uh, aren't where we want them to be. At Owensboro High School, less than half of white and Hispanic or Latino 10th graders read at a proficient level. Only 26% of African American 10th graders at the school hit that benchmark. This is not a problem that happened overnight. Reverend Rondell and Randolph is the president of Owensboro's NAACP branch, which maintains a presence in Owensboro High School with students managing their own chapter. They bring in different speakers uh, to talk about different career paths and how they can make uh, kids can make different choices on where they want to focus their time. Reverend Randolph stresses that helping African American students close the gap with their peers in educational success requires mentoring and help outside of school. There does need to be some type of uh, extra effort. In other area high schools like Henderson County High School, the divide is even more severe. Among 10th graders, 51% of white students and 36% of Hispanic or Latino students read at a proficient level, but only 14% of African American students hit the benchmark. Owensboro Public Schools is working to address the demographic divide early. At the elementary level, which is obviously where you know you want to get most of this work done uh, on the reading side of things, we've adopted a district-wide curriculum for all of our elementary students. So they're all reading the same thing. They're all working from the same curriculum. If you'd like to find out how your local school performed, you can visit our website at wevv.com. Reporting in Owensboro, Josh Myers, 44 News.